Whoa, we got an update on this class action lawsuit. There's more than 100 victims stepping forward and getting involved in this class action lawsuit against Diddy. Wow. What's up, y'all? Listen, guys. Things have been getting crazy, as we already know. We've been on this crazy train, this crazy Diddy train, for a minute now, and it still keeps on spiraling spiraling, and getting crazy and going out of control. Now, don't let this title fool you now, okay? Because now there's more than just 50 clients that are stepping forward and getting involved in this class action lawsuit. Now, this lawyer, okay, Tony Busby, apparently is a big time lawyer. He is not to be played with, and he is the one spearheading this new class, the class action lawsuit. And now we're understanding that now it's doubled in size. A hundred clients have spoken out and are uh, on this class action lawsuit against Diddy. And he's saying that a good portion of these people were minors, littles, when this whole thing went down. We got to take a look at this article, guys. This is absolutely crazy. Okay, so without further ado, let's knock at this thing out. So Houston lawyer Tony Busby announced that he would be representing more than 50. We now understand that it's 100 alleged victims in a new lawsuit against Sean Diddy Combs, okay? And uh, this is according to a social media post that was put up Thursday, okay? Now, obviously, uh, new information has come out. At the time, it was 50, but now it's 100 individuals. But I think his statement here is a very big deal, and I, I, I wanted to share this with you guys. And also on top of this, let's not forget, he's allegedly going to be holding a press conference sometime to sometime this at the, earlier this week, which we do have some more information about that, and I'm going to share that with you guys, uh, with that information before the end of this uh, this video here, okay? Uh, so hit that like button down below. Don't forget to subscribe, all right? Show some love. Hit that follow button if you're watching on other platforms, all right? But he says here, this group of brave individuals include both men and women, which we've been hearing a lot of men and women stepping forward now, okay? Many were young. Many were not legal. OK, when the A occurred, we got to use these code words. OK, and this is what he said in a statement. Each individual story is gut wrenching and heartbreaking. And if it's anything like the lawsuits that we've read, the, the scathing lawsuits that we've read as of late. Yeah, I bet they are gut wrenching and heartbreaking. Continuing on, the violations against this group of individuals are mind boggling and can only be described as debauchery and depravity exacted by powerful people against minors and the weak. Now, one thing before we continue on, one thing I do want to say is if there are, as he says, associates of Combs, where, where they arrest at? Why, why aren't we seeing more people doing the perp walk? Why aren't we seeing these mother lovers in shackles doing the, doing the, 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 the prisoner shuffle? The shackle shuffle. Why are we seeing that? Where are they at? We hear and understand about these enter this the Combs Enterprise saying that he had cohorts, uh, people in high places, so on and so forth, working and cooperating, uh, or, or co co uh, cooperating with him, trying to help him put together and, and exact these type of freak offs. Now we're understanding these littles are involved. Where are the other arrests? That's the thing I want to know. Let's continue on, though. All right. We he also said that he uh, asked any possible any other possible alleged uh, individuals seeking assistance to come forward and contact his law firm. OK, he says, I expect many other individuals to be implicated. OK, many other influence and many other individuals will be implicated. So arrests more arrests coming soon more lawsuits being dropped on not only just diddy but other people his associates so if that's the case we might hear names huge names dropping here very very soon which will be wild y'all and i'm here for it continuing on we expect to have a press conference early next week where some of these uh stories can be told as the nation learns more and grapples with the potential scope of this scam scandal. Our firm 
has always been at the forefront of the most important cases in the United States. We are proud to represent this group of brave souls and pray for justice on their behalf. And we already know that there's been more and more lawsuits dropping. I think there's going to be a 13th lawsuit from another Jane Doe dropping, I think, as soon as today, possibly. Okay? Because uh, we did see a lawyer go on to Banfield's show on News Nation talking about uh, this Jane Doe's experience, this horrific experience that she also went through. Again, like I said, the, the diddler been diddling, diddling about here, and it's it's bad. But I know a lot of you guys are wondering about this press conference, and so I wanted to give you guys that update as well. All right. So apparently they are going to have Busby will be conducting some sort of uh, press conference tomorrow. And let me show you this. Okay. He's going to be dropping some serious stuff because, like I said, they're saying now that they have over 100 alleged victims coming forward with claims of R, S, A, and S exploitation. Like I said, this is insane, y'all. And again, all these victims did not only go through these crimes by just Diddy. These are other individuals that, that are involved in this situation, and there might be some celebrity names that get dropped tomorrow they're holding this press conference tomorrow at 1 p.m if i'm correct i think that's central standard time not sure but i'll let you guys know because you know for a fact we'll be watching it here live on the show on my main channel so make sure you're subscribed over there as well okay but still pretty wild stuff here okay tomorrow they're going to be doing this and apparently they're going to drop some bombshells tomorrow so again guys this is absolutely horrific absolutely shocking that now we have a hundred let me repeat that again 100 individuals stepping forward in a class action lawsuit against the diddler and they got some stories to tell i know we're all here for it but like i said this train has been going off the rails and just going straight down this dark dark tunnel of oblivion but anyway guys that's the video comment down below let me know what your thoughts are you know again you know i understand that some might some might sit there and go oh it's all fake news and we can't trust and believe all of them sure but i'm hoping that the lawyers are sifting through who's actually fibbing who's actually telling the truth that's what i'm hoping that they're doing that's part of their job right to make sure that these cases are solid um, and that they make sense, right? And that they're truthful. So I guess all we could do is sit back, wait, and hope that they're doing their due diligence, right? Other than that, man, he's been doing this for decades, guys. So imagine just do, let's just, let's just scrunch it down to just 10 years because he's been doing this for decades, plural, decades, okay? But let's just scrunch it down for a second and think about this. How many freak-off parties that he's been doing? He probably has been doing a lot of them. So if you're just doing, if you're just doing 10 years, 100 is very small for what we're hearing about these parties, okay? So if he's been doing this for decades, I wouldn't be surprised if this gets up to about 200 individuals. And I'm talking about from not only people who are saying that they were victims, uh, uh, and being a part of this class action lawsuit. I'm also saying adding on top the individual lawsuits that are being filed right now as we speak. Like I said, there's a 13th one that should be dropping, uh, a lawsuit that should be filed today. Again, this is crazy. And we're here watching it all on the sidelines as it all goes up in flames. Anyway, guys, Comment down below. Let me know what your thoughts are. Hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to hit that like button on this video. Hit that follow button if you're watching on other platforms. Of course, it'd be great to have you a part of the Pascal Show family on all these platforms, okay? Uh, man, this is... I did not expect any of this. <laughs> you know what I mean? This is some wild stuff, but we'll talk here soon. Be good to yourselves. Be good to one another. Talk to you guys soon. This is the Pascal Show. Bye. P A S C A L. You are now rocking with that dude, Pascal. We be going wild.